Welcome back to Minecraft Survival with Redstone. Today we are going to be doing episode 4, which is going to be about... Uh, we're going to do like a... How would you put it? A railway ladder from the mine shaft straight up. And we're going to try and come up to like right here or over there or something. So that it comes into here and it's more easier. Because I'm tired of getting, you know, losing a chicken wing from coming up these stairs. So let's get down there and... I've went ahead and gotten all the materials that we're going to need. I probably overdid it a little bit. So let's go see. Oh, and I know where that is. It's just a single, it's not a spawner. So it's just a weirdo guy. And we're going to start it here. I've kind of started doing it so that we can know where to go. Um, that way we can know which way to face. Um, you can see I've dressed it up a little bit. It's the hub. There is a natural water source right here if you guys wanted to know. If you heard the water move around and you heard you're following. So if that's there. We get ourselves like a little fountain. And I finished exploring this one. The only thing that's in there that's left is obsidian. I made a little storage area because I was filling these up too fast. I explored this area. There is a zombie spawner in there, so I think after this we'll do a zombie spawner or do a uh, mob grinder in there. It's my own version. I've I'll show you. I got two different ones. We got a simple one, and there's a um, a more complex one, but we'll get to that later. So let's get what we need, and I think I put that over here. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So we need rail. Redstone, powered rail. You know, and I want to show you how to make some powered rail. So let's get, we need redstone anyways. Okay, so to make powered rail, we've got rail, redstone torches, and buttons. And the way that you make redstone torches, we'll start with that, is you just do it like a regular torch. You just put redstone and then boom, you got yourself a torch. To make a button, you take smooth stone and you put it just like a torch or a stick and you get yourself a button. And then to do a rail, you put iron ore on the outside with a stick in the middle and you get yourself rail. Now we need some, where's the metals? Metals and ores, okay. We need some of this one, two, three, four, five, six. To make powered rail, we do it just like the regular rail, but with with gold on the outside and redstone on the bottom with sticks in the middle, and we get powered rail. Okay. That's it should be about it. We got about everything. We don't need this. Let's put this here, because we don't need it. You know what? Do we have, did I, oh uh, well. Well, anyway, okay. Let's go ahead and get started. Now, when we came down, I don't know if you noticed, I should have mentioned it, but basically the hub is facing us right now. Um, we can't see it, obviously, but we're, we're facing in the direction that the hub is, or that our little hideout is. So we're okay with that. We need to basically start just going straight up, and we should be fine. Now, hey, I got something to ask you guys. If you've seen the new um, update that they're going to be releasing here shortly, um, it's a jungle biome. Have you seen that? That has got to be the coolest thing I've ever seen. I can't wait to get in there and test it out. I mean, it's it's awesome. If you guys haven't seen it, I believe Chimney Swift. I'll have to find it and put it. I'll put it in like the upper portion or something up on this video. But he's got a um, like a review. He did a all right job on it, but. Anyway, so um, it looks pretty stinking cool, and I, I can't wait to actually play in it because it kind of reminds me of, like, I don't know, uh, 
don't know if any of you guys have ever seen Predator or maybe even just Avatar. Kind of reminds me of Avatar, so let's see. Maybe we should see how high we are. Okay, that's good. So how, where did we come across? That means that we came okay so we would go up there we turn left and then we go up a ladder and then we go up some more stairs so we need to make a turn yeah we need to do a turn so let's go one more in and then we'll make our turn like that Okay, so um, to make this a little less painful for you guys, I'm going to go ahead and probably guys are going to be like, no, don't. How, do you prefer me? Do you like me doing time lapses? Is if you do, because some I, I have this feeling like it gives you guys headaches, and I don't want to do it if it gives you guys headaches. So let me know if you guys are getting headaches by me doing time lapses, because if you are, I don't want to. I don't want to give you like make you sick or anything so all right so let me uh we're gonna get going Okay, guys, well, we reached the other side. Um, hopefully you saw the way I did it. I just opened up the coordinates like so, matched up the X, Y, and Z, and I did it from the bottom. I stopped at one point to figure out if I needed to go right or left, up or down. Okay, sorry, I had to cut out for a second. So I started down lower, and I wrote down some coordinates and where we are pretty much, well, this location right here. Um, I wrote down those, co wow, I think my keyboard just died. Manually restart the game. Oh, hey, it works. Oh, man. Okay, so my magic, or the keyboard just had just about a conniption fit, so all right, well, let's get keep going all right well oh and I'm I've been sick for a, a couple of days now and so I'm doing this out of because uh, um, I really want to get this out and I really have been pre prepping for this episode for forever I mean we released that one uh, bonus episode with Carter a couple days ago so um, I've been pretty pretty busy 
making sure that we have enough stuff for this episode. So what you're going to want to do is you're going to make sure that the top area of where you're going to be stopping has a lot, a lot of clearance. And we're going to put one right there. And then we're going to, here, I just realized, let's get rid of this. Uh, we're going to want to put, let's take some of this, take that out of the way, put this in, get this out of the way. That's probably good for right now. All right. So we want this here, that there, take this out. And we want to get some redstone. We don't need a bow. Put the redstone here. And we don't need the axe. Put our button. You know, I'm going to have to go find those guys to make sure. I almost want to put like dirt behind that button. Something other than that. Uh, for now, let's put some, let's put some wood. Okay, we'll pretty up, pretty, pretty it up in a minute. So we got that going. Let's do a blank here. So when we come back, we'll hit this. Now, whenever you come back on one of these unpowered ones, you like immediately stop. So you don't have to worry about I mean, sometimes you're going so fast that you'll come up on this, and that's why we have that that block there, so that it'll stop you. But uh, what you really want to make sure is when you... The reason I've got this tilted is because when you put a minecart on it, even if it was flat like that, it wouldn't like go anywhere. It would be just still. So whatever momentum you've got going is the way it's going to go. So since we're tilting it forward like that, it's going to want to go forward. And so I have done these points where the torches are. And I've done that because every spot that a torch is, I want to put a powered rail. And the reason that is is because I want to make sure that the rail has power. So, and you don't have to do it, but like every 10, oops, what's the wrong one? 10 or 15. I think so. I think that's about what it is, 10 or 15. But when you're going uphill, it can get whoa, mouse is going nuts. When you're going uphill, ooh, I think I finally found them. That annoying sound. Should I go get them? If I can find the edge. Let's just fall down there. What in the world? Have I been down here before? Oh, dude, is that a spawner? That's a spawner. <laughs> oh, I guess where we're going next next episode, that's a spawner. All right, to to get them to shut up. Oh, <laughs> let's light up the area. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. It's a spawner. That is awesome. Let's see if we can come around this way and do it like that. Get away from there. Get away from there. Let's do a bow low. Do you really want me to do that, buddy? I don't mind the XP, but come on. Seriously. Wow. Okay, that's that's awesome. Alright, hey dude, you left? Alright, let's get you out of there. <laughs> that is awesome. <laughs> I mean, I swear, every time I'm on the video with you guys, I've been looking for... I've been looking for a, uh, um, a skeleton spawner forever, and it ends up being right next to our base. 
Okay, well, that's some good stuff. What else we got over here? Eh. All right, well, this is a good place. This is where we'll do a spawner, because I didn't want to do the zombie spawner, but we'll do one right there. That is awesome. Okay, so our track is up there. Let's let's get up this way. And I'm trying to figure out I think yeah, there we go. No, not cool. Let's go this way. Oh, that's better. Oh, we can even see it from here. All right, cool. Um, let's cover this up. Nah, probably not want to do that, but... Um, for now, we'll do that. That is awesome. Okay. Now, our video is really long. Oh, uh, man. Oh, that's awesome. All right, well, you know, let's put some cobblestone in, get rid of this wood. I should have got a bigger stack. All right. Okay, so the minecart, when it gets tilted, it'll come traveling really fast. We won't have any issues. This is going to be sweet. We can put like a trunk right here, a chest right there. We'll go here, 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 here. We'll put a powered rail here. We'll break out this and put a redstone torch there. And then we'll do that. See how there's another one there on oh, iron. I'll have to come back and get those because we don't have that much time. So we want to always, what you want to do is place your powered rail first and then the redstone torch. Because if you do it the other direction, and you know what, I wonder, oh, dang it, I forgot that you can't turn corners like that, dang it. Hmm. Um. I was telling you guys something and it was good and I don't remember what it was. Um, who knows? All right, well, you want to keep the redstone t uh, together, close together because, okay, so that's not, that's not, we got to do another one here. We have to put it close together. That, that'd be better. I think I was probably talking about those torches burning out, but we'll keep going down. Man, I still just can't get over that spawner being right there. That is awesome. <laughs> Um, you know what? Let's do another one right here. Oh. Let's see. Oh. Weird. Alright, well I guess I was wrong. I take it back. Okay, so... Yoink. And we're coming up on the end here pretty quick. Should be anyways. Because that water is close. Oh, dang it. You know, and I wonder about the ceiling if it's not high enough. I bet you. We'll see, won't we? All right.
so what we're doing is ooh, that might be a stretch. You know what? I think we'll do since that's a quite a big stretch. Is let's bust up this one, put another powered rail on it. Yeah, that was so great. It'll grab it and launch it faster. Yeah, that's a good idea. All right, bust this down. Put a torch here. Put a red torch there. Put that there. That there. Please turn. Do. No. All right. Fine. We'll make it do a twisty turn here, like that. And we'll do that. You like. Since I'm not putting them out in the open, let's continue the trend, eh? I believe that's the bottom. That's the bottom right there. Okay. So, torch, redstone. And torch, redstone. Oh, there's coal here. I'll have to come back and get it later. Oh, what did I just do that for? All right. Hey, hey. I don't think uh, I expected to get this done in one go. This that's that's cool that we're getting this done in one go. Might be a long one, but uh, it's better than a short one. All right. There's another torch. Jeez. You know, let's go through and get all these. Since we're doing so many. Okay, we thought of that on this one, so we'll put this. Wow, I, did, I guess I didn't have to make so much rail. I have lots of it. Okay, yoink, 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 yoink. Okay, and let's bust down this one. And this one. And we'll do a powered rail here. And there. I have it powered. Dead. Uh, put our button here and have our powered with a there. And I believe the ceiling is high enough. So let's go ahead and make our rail. I mean, our Minecraft, our minecart, <laughs> Minecraft cart. We got enough. Yeah, we got plenty. Okay. The way you do that is you put iron like this. Give me. And we put it in our inventory. Put it on there by right clicking. You can hop in by right clicking. Right click a button. And we're off. Oh, I had a feeling. I had a feeling. Okay. Okay, so I knew it. I knew oh I missed it. Okay. That's why you always test. You always test. Okay. Let's go back down there and do this again. Man, that's actually kind of uh, depressing that that happened. Sorry, guys. Let's do this again. You're probably watching and like, um, you, fog you forgot one. Uh, you might want to get that one. You forgot it. Oh, oh. I called that, didn't I? I called it. All right. Well, I guess let's do this. So I can grab that last one. All right, one last time. Let's let's uh, <laughs> we're gonna do this again. All right, I you know I don't think I've ever had this much problems with the uh, rails before. Okay, so turning, grab it, grab it, good, good, good. Oh, and we made it. Okay, that's it, guys. So next time, we're going to attack that spawner, heck yeah, and I'll show you guys how to make the sweetest mob grinder ever, alright, do the one punchers, one punch grinder, alright, well, we'll see you guys next time, I had fun.